like me, man. I love the game. I love the hustle, man. Be feeling like one of the ball playing, you know, bird of magic or something. March. Oh man, have a lovely day. This is how we're starting today's vlog, ladies and gentlemen, with Starbucks. And it's literally 77 degrees out, so it was only right to take out the Hellcat. Well, good morning, guys. I hope you guys are having a great day. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got another banger for you guys. And no, the title is not a clickbait. just see that it's literally flashing the check engine light again I don't know what's wrong with this car and why it's doing that someone told me it could be an ignition problem someone told me it could be bad fuel that is being put in this car I don't know what is exactly going on with this car the last time I went out and tried to data log it and try to catch it doing that it didn't do that so the check engine light is not staying on so I don't know what code is throwing up, so it's really driving me nuts. And today we're going to be selling my old Red Eye steering wheel. This is a full Alcantara steering wheel, and I no longer have a use for it. And shout out to him right there. He just bought my Alcantara steering wheel. He has a very clean Go Mango scat pack. And one of his buddies also turned out to have a Chrysler 300 with a Hellcat swap. So I told him we definitely got to link up, and we might even race. So we're back here with Joey, same salesman that helped Help me out with my Hellcat. Here is his info before we start. Screenshot that, hit him up if you need a car. Thank you. Now he's gonna take us through the process of ordering another Hellcat. We're gonna be building a budget Hellcat. That's exactly what we're gonna do here. We're not gonna go all out because we still have a Hellcat outside, which is mine, with pretty much every single option. So we're gonna try to spec it out to be kind of a budget Hellcat and I'll show you guys everything once we're done. But look at how beautiful she is looking. So it's lowered now, painted wheels. If you guys haven't been keeping up with the videos, it looks so good. I'm definitely gonna keep this. And then we got this Rubicon right here. That is nice. It might be a 392. <laughs> yep, it is a 392. It sounds so good. But anyways, now I'm gonna show you guys the spec of this new Hellcat. If you guys are asking me, hey, why are you getting another Hellcat? And my answer is simply, I don't know, but we are getting one and it'll probably be here in two to three months. So here's the build sheet. It's a charger, wide body, obviously 6.2 liter, it's smoke chauffeur color, red interior, then we got the sunroof, then we got the navigation and travel group, and then uh, that's pretty much it. And the sticker on that is $82,000. So let me know what you guys think of my spec in the comments below. <laughs> So I swapped out the Hellcat for the GT500 and now we're gonna go, go. Actually, I don't know where we're gonna go, but I'm sure I'm gonna figure it out. Hey, my friend. What's going on? How you doing? Good, good. Come L in. Look. You ordered another Hellcat? Yes, sir. For what? So we can both drive Me? together, yeah. No way. Oh, yeah, bro. Hey, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Free food on you? Free food on me, come on. All right, but let me get the paper back, though. Why, it's mine. I mean, yeah, but like I have to track the order number, like. Alright, can I take a picture? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. So we're here and there's no falafel. What's up with that? We sold out. Sold out? No, it doesn't even look like there was any in there. No, there was. Yeah, you can still feel it. So it was still hot. A little bit. Okay, you know what? No Hellcat for you. What do you mean? You have to give me something else. Well, there's no falafel. Alright, come here. Come on, you gotta feed me. I'm hungry. I can't feed you. But I can give you some E85. Bro, not with this E85. This is not E85, bro. Just because it's corn. It doesn't mean it's E85. So what do you want? Food! So Carlo finally found something for me to eat. What do we got for? We got you an apple. A red apple from Washington. Fresh. Just picked. Just picked from Washington? Just picked from Washington. Like Washington, D.C.? Washington, D.C., yeah. They flew it like, out to here. First but, class but, but how come you're trying to like feed me something healthy? Are you trying to say something? Uh, I'm not, no, I'm not saying anything. You're not trying to say, like, I need to eat no, healthier, right? No, of course not, but if the shoe fits, you know, wear it. No, no, the shoe doesn't fit. You can have it. No, I'm good. So, what do you, okay, you want? 
<laughs> okay, perfect. Thank you, you so much. Man? Thank you. <laughs> is that a crashed Raptor? Holy moly. That thing is destroyed. Let's take a look at this. I wonder what it is. It looks like a Raptor, but it's not. What is this? Oh, it's a Sierra. And it's completely destroyed. And Martin now has to move it. And he's like 6'2". So I wonder how you're gonna try to get in there. Oh, I mean, I can just squeeze in there, just squeeze in there. Yeah, but... Let's see if it turns on first. Yeah, bro. It's like a Rolls Royce. Oh, yeah, right. It's Dro a drop top. <laughs> hey, you know, this is what they mean when they say drop top. This yeah. thing drops. <laughs> I don't even need tip, bro. They can't even see me. <laughs> And now I'm giving the GT500 a little bath because it definitely needs it. And now we're going to show the wheels some love. Thanks, Gantian. <laughs> So I have back in the Hellcat, of course I had to shower and change and get all dressed up because we're gonna go meet up with a bunch of friends, cruise and just see some cool cars. This is literally the slowest pump in the world. Look how slow it's going. But at least they give you a heads up and also, look at that, that's pretty funny. But honestly, shout out to whoever's responsible for these gas prices because they're looking real good. Look at this beautiful C8. That thing is beautiful. We got a bunch of cars here. We got this, and then we got my car. Look how pretty she is sitting. And we also need a Red Bull. And we're also gonna take this. We got a beautiful SS right here. Oof, sounds so good. And they're shutting us down. Look at this. All right, we gotta go somewhere else now. All right, so we're gonna try to go to a different spot because the cops don't want us to be here. And the cops are still pulling people over. But check out this Lexus. This thing is a V8, it's Nardo gray, and it has one of the most beautiful rear ends I've ever seen on a car. Look at this thing. So aggressive. This thing has like 470 horsepower. Look how beautiful it is. Love the body lines, like crazy body lines on here. And the front end is also beautiful too, look at this. I was told this is the only one in Michigan. And we also got a Durango Hellcat here. Look at this thing, it's beautiful, especially in the silver. And look at this lineup. So we got a couple bikes right here. We got the twin turbo R8. We have a Z06 right here. We have the M4 right here. We have a S63 AMG right here. Look at those brakes. That's beautiful. We got Gentian right there. We got an M5 right here. We have an Audi here. We have a Hellcat here. CTSV here. And then a Jeep SRT. This is one heck of a lineup. And look who decided to show up. Hey! Hey, they need help sliding it. Can you slide a Hellcat for us? Let's go. So this is my old red eye. Hey bro, you got a teacher. scared I don't know what happened here but that was good that was actually real that was real good look at these <laughs> and that's all I got for you guys leave a like comment make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys on the next one peace